The uncertainty about Ricky Ramey's future as Lynn Avon's police chief was resolved today. Ramey appeared at a virtual court hearing this morning where he accepted a plea deal for a hit and run incident in December. As News 13's Courtney Fegley tells us, the deal allows Ramey to return to his job eventually. Lynn Haven Police Chief Ricky Ramey pled no contest Thursday morning to the misdemeanor charge of leaving the scene of an accident with property damage. Ramey hit a car in the parking lot of Miss Newby's Lounge around 3 a.m. December 30th. Mr. Ramey, I'm going to accept your plea of no contest in case 24-691-CT to the charge of leaving the scene of an accident with damages of more than $50 withhold adjudication of guilt. Ramey's defense attorney, Waylon Graham, says the charge is almost the equivalent of a speeding ticket. I tell people when they ask me, well, how, how low a crime is that? And I will explain that it's one notch above a speeding ticket because a second degree misdemeanor is the least criminal crime we have on the books. Ramey will not face jail time or even probation, but there are some legal conditions. One was to pay a small fine. One was to write a letter of apology. One was to take a, a, a vehicle safety course and then to pay restitution to the gentleman whose vehicle he bumped into if there's any out-of-pocket expenses. That will fulfill his obligations to the state, but the city of Lynn Haven has placed its own conditions on Ramey in order for him to keep his job. City manager Vicki Gaynor issued a lengthy statement spelling out the requirements. First, Ramey will be suspended for 25 days without pay beginning Friday, August 23rd. He must surrender his police credentials, city-issued firearm, vehicle, badge, and laptop. He cannot engage in law enforcement activity. He must not contact any city officials or employees except as an average citizen. Once he's completed his suspension, Ramey can return to his job as police chief, but he will be on a short leash. Gaynor says any further lapses of judgment will not be tolerated. Any future violation of city police or unacceptable act that demonstrates a lack of professionalism, judgment, or leadership will result in Ramey's immediate termination. Graham says Ramey is remorseful and is taking accountability for his actions. Feels terrible about what happened, feels terrible about bumping into the man's car, uh, and uh, all of this has weighed heavily on him. In Lynn Haven, Courtney Fegley, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Deputy Chief Steve Enfinger will continue to serve as acting Lynn Haven Chief of Police during Ramey's suspension.